Welcome to Judica County. I'm your host, Taylor Scruggs Smith, and I'm here with Kimberly Lott, and we are both attorneys with Whitaker & Hamer, your law firm for life with offices across the state of North Carolina. Today we want to touch on criminal law a little bit generally. Um, this is an area that Kim primarily practices in and has spent most of her career in. So you've, somebody's been charged with a crime. It's not a DWI, it's not traffic. They've been charged with some other type of crime. Why do they need an attorney? They need an attorney because their freedom is at stake, honestly. And so they need the wisdom and advice from somebody who has handled many criminal cases to know where to go next. Um, and as a criminal attorney with that type of experience, what are your kind of go-to points, maybe like the one-on-one -on -one points for somebody that has just gotten a charge? Um, they've obviously may have been released or on bail or something, but they just got charged. Sure. The first thing is to call me, <laughs> call us, and so that we can sit down and discuss a strategy. When it comes to having been charged with crimes, there are a lot of different ways to attack it, and we can sit down and evaluate what is the best course of action to take. Um, and then, so you obviously know criminal procedure better. When would you say is the best time to hire an attorney and maybe like, okay, this is your last chance. You got to get one by this point or you might be messed up in terms of your freedom. Sure. So I would say, I want to answer that question in two ways. The earliest time to contact an attorney is if you think you're going to be charged with a crime. The police are talking to you. They're asking you a whole bunch of questions and you are afraid that you are going to be charged with a crime. The things to remember then are you don't have to give the police any information. You don't have to talk to the police. You don't have to cooperate with the police. You don't have to tell them anything. It is their job to figure things out. So it's better to call an attorney at that stage, have an attorney with you if you're going to talk to the police. Uh, I can help someone figure out when to talk to the police, how to talk to the police, what kind of questions to answer. Sometimes we want to be very cooperative with the police, but do it in such a way that it protects your rights. A, a citizen is afforded a lot of rights under the Constitution, and we want to make sure that those rights are protected. So call me before you even get charged if you know that you're under investigation. The last possible time to call me is before you go to court for the first time. It doesn't help if you wait the day before your court date to give me a call, or you've been to court several times and then wait, you've waited to call. So call as early as possible. As soon as you've been charged with something is the best time to call an attorney. And just so the viewers at home are clear, what counties do you practice criminal law in? I practice criminal law in Wake County, Durham County, and Johnston County mainly. All right, so that's one, tons of wonderful information and we wanted to make sure we got that out. So we appreciate you coming on the show and we thank you at home for joining us on this episode of Judica County. If you find yourself in need of legal assistance with a criminal law or any area of law, give us a call at 919-772-7000 or contact us via our website at wh.lawyer. Again, we are Whitaker & Hamer, your law firm for life.